All rise, we are good away. The International Residual Mechanism for Criminal Tribunals is now in session. Please be seated. In accordance with the scheduling order issued on 3rd October 2021 and pursuant to Rule 144D of the Mechanism's Rules of Procedure and Evidence, the Appeals Chamber will now pronounce the judgment in the case of Prosecutor versus Radcom Mladic. Mr. Mladic, please stand while I read the text of the disposition in the Appeals Chamber. For the foregoing reason, the Appeals Chamber dismisses Mr. Mladic's appeal in its entirety, Judge Nyambe distinctly, as to grounds one, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, and nine of Mr. Mladic's appeal. Dismisses Judge Ngam and Judge Peton dissenting the prosecution's appeal in its entirety. Affirms Judge Ngam and Judge Peton dissenting the disposition of the trial chamber finding that Mr. Mladic is not guilty of genocide under count one of the indictment. Affirms the disposition of the trial chamber finding Mr. Mladic of taking hostages as a violation of the laws or customs of war under count 11 of the indictment. But to, pursuant to Article 7 of the IC2 statute, and further affirms Judge Nyambe dissenting the disposition of the trial chamber finding Mr. Blood guilty of genocide under count of the indictment, persecution as a crime against humanity, count three of the indictment, extermination as a crime against humanity under count four of the indictment. Murder as a crime against humanity under count five of the indictment, as a, as a violation of the laws or customs of war under count six of the indictment, deportation as a crime against humanity under count seven of the indictment, inhumane as forcible transfer as a crime against humanity under count eight of the indictment, terror as a violation of the laws or customs of war under count nine of the indictment, unlawful act, acts on civilians as a violation of the laws or customs of war under count 10 of the indictment, pursuant to Article 7 1 of the ICTY statute, affirms Judge Nyambe dissenting the sentence of life in prison imposed on Mr. Mlazi by the trial chamber rules that this judgment shall be enforced immediately pursuant to Rule 145A of the rules, and orders that in accordance with Rule 127C and 133 of the rules, Mr. Mladic shall remain in the custody of the mechanism pending the finalization of the arrangements for his transfer to the state where he will serve the sentence. <laughs> 